Hey defenders, welcome back to our channel. Today I have a breaking news. This breaking news is about a massive data breach that happened in the US government Pentagon itself. Let's dive deep to understand more about this attack. Hackers have leaked internal documents from Lados Holding Incorporation, one of the largest IT providers for the Pentagon. That is the US government itself. Lados is a major player in the IT services sector, working with clients like Pentagon, the Department of Homeland Security, NASA, NSA, etc. It was also re revealed that sensitive documents linked to Lidos were leaked online. This breach is believed to be connected with the two past hacks that had happened on Diligent Corporation back in 2020. What is Diligent? Before that, Lidos uses Diligent systems to host information related to in internal investigation. So when there are breaches that occur, it puts their whole data in risk. Lidos did confirm that the leaked documents are from their earlier incident. They stated that this is a breach that did not compromise their own network but or any sensitive customer data. The spokesperson mentioned, we have confirmed that this stems from a previous incident that affects third party vendor for which all necessary notifications are made in 2023. Despite of reassurances, shares of Lidos fell over 4% after the attack took place. However, they have seen a remarkable rise in their stock, gaining over 40% this year. So what about Diligent Corporation? They stated that leaks appearing to be from hack affecting their subsidiary Steely Compliance Solutions, which they acquired in 2021. Diligent notified Lidos about the breach that happened in 2022 and took immediate actions to contain this incident going forward. At the time of the breach, fewer than just 15 customers were using the product, including Lidos themselves. Are you someone who uses multiple governance risk and compliance product? Are you someone who has experience using governance risk and compliance product? Please do share in your comment in the section below. I would personally read them and re respond back to each comments that I receive. And if you are someone who likes this content or if you are someone who thinks someone would love to hear a content like this, consider sharing and subscribing. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech insights on cybersecurity.